Big Zeus Big body Zeus building. Body building. Body building. Body building. What's going on, world? You are tuned into Big Zeus Bodybuilding. Just doing a little stretch in action here. Just got done with an intense back workout. I got some coffee for my post workout. Good stuff. Yeah, I drink coffee post workout instead of pre workout. Anyhow, this video is going to go right along in line with the beginner's workout series. It's about your range of motion. Now, I just recently put up a video for the beginner's quad workout. And somebody had commented on the video about the squat exercise. Uh, do a full squat next time, bro, or some, something along those lines. Well, what this cat fails to understand or fails to realize is that Everybody's range of motion is different. Now, me personally, I was in a car accident uh, a long time ago. That long ago, I know. And as a result of that car accident, I have a bad left knee, I have a bad left elbow, and I have a bad left shoulder. Now, my range of motion on my knee is limited I can't squat down as far as the next person can but what I'm doing when I squat I'm working my muscles to their full potential I'm using the range of motion that I have that my knee allows and that's what's important for beginners it's difficult to understand or you know it's it takes a while to get used to Everybody bombards you with do it this way, do it that way. You you got to go further, you got to go deeper. Well, listen now. Everybody's range of motion is different. You have to be in tune with your body and you have to know what your body is capable of. Otherwise, you are going to get up in you you're going to end up injured trying to listen to the ne the jack wagon next to you telling you how to do it, but he doesn't feel what you're feeling in your body and in your muscles in your joints now say you're doing a bench press right you can only come up this far but when you come up this far you're working your muscles to their full potential that's your range of motion the guy next to you he might go up here right and he's telling you you need to go up further well guess what you can't because your range of motion is different than his you're doing what's best for your body now he might not be able to go back down as far as you because his range of motion is different. But it's just something that you have to learn to block out when people try and tell you how to do things. You know, there's a difference in somebody training you and giving you the proper advice and the proper precautions to prevent injury rather than just somebody who's, you know, blindly just telling you, hey, you got to do it this way. But yet they have no idea how your body functions so the main point of this is to you know kind of give you the idea to, to keep in your head what your body is capable of you have to learn your body all right and know that your range of motion and the way you do an exercise is going to look different than the next 10 guys next to you and they're all going to look different from the next 10 guys next to them because not everybody's body works exactly the same way. Whether it be injuries that limit you, uh, you know, there's other, there's bone conditions, there's muscle conditions. There's a variety of things that are going to hinder or, you know, limit or give you a greater range of motion. Some people can hyperflex their joints, they're double jointed, they can go two ways with it, you know. Not everybody can do that. But, you know, just keep that in mind, all right? Don't let others get you down talking about you're not doing it right or you need to do more. You do what's best for you, and you do what works for you. As long as you're working your muscles to the full potential and you're getting a great workout and great results, that's all that matters, all right? Till next time, keep pumping!
democratic if they do why well because ever since the 80s ended there has been a non-stop effort to mischaracterize them